It was the 23rd century, mankind's darkest hour. Heart rate and respiration. Now, life support online. Initiating cryogenic freezing. Fighting for so long, no one could remember the reason why it all started in the first place. All we knew is that there were two sides, the Coalition and the Alliance. For decades, millions died for the same piece of rock again and again. Finally, one side managed to gain the upper hand, the Coalition. The Alliance launched five sleeper ships. The hope was for them to begin again far from the war and strife that had befallen Earth, to start free from the prejudices that had divided us for so long. Each sleeper ship was christened after its patron nation. The Britonia, the Rhineland, the Hispania, the Casari, the Liberty. ships broke through the coalition blockade and headed for the Sirius system. That was 800 years ago when we came here to rebuild our lives. We've come a long way since then. We have grown. We have prospered. We have flourished. But we will never forget. asked the LSF to investigate the sudden destruction of Freeport 7. No word yet on whether it was accidental or a deliberate attack. The first handful of survivors arrived on Manhattan this morning.
We're here for medical. Is there anyone seriously injured? One. Inside. Make sure he lives. He owes me some credits. Your concern is touching. We'll do everything we can. It may take a while. Officially, the Liberty Security Force maintains there is no proof Freeport 7's destruction was deliberate. But sources inside the LSF say they suspect the dangerous criminal organization, The Order. We will keep you up to date as the story develops. Sidewinder Fang. All we have is Liberty Ale, friend. Fine. Her name's Junko Zane. She's a tough one. Oh, well, why's that? She's LSF. All business. If it's a job you're wanting, that is. On the other hand, if you're looking for something more. Well, the only thing I'm looking for right now is this drink. I know you. No. No, I don't think so. The news. I saw your face on the news. You're one of the Freeport 7 survivors, aren't you? Yeah. I heard it was pretty bad out there. You know, you're lucky to be alive. Ha. Huh. This one's on me, friend. It's the good stuff. Why? Because it's not every day a man has the chance to start again, huh? To your good fortune and liberty, sir. Well, it can't get any worse. Thanks. I understand what you're saying, but I don't have nearly enough people. Junie, the environment has changed. Well, with groups like the Order taking more and more liberties, indeed now threatening our profits, some in the government feel that we need to increase our patrols in these areas. <clears throat> You, Junko Zane? Yes? I believe you have business to discuss. Wait! I will leave this matter in your capable hands. Sorry. The bartender said you work for the Liberty Security Force. And who do you work for, Mr. Uh... Trent. I work for myself. What kind of ship do you have? I lost mine on Freeport 7. I see. Are you staying in Liberty long? I've got a friend who was injured in the attack. He's in medical. I'll be staying at least until he's released. Well, as it happens, I could use a good freelancer, Mr. Trent. I'll be in the equipment room later. You can meet me there. Oh, and if we are going to work together, call me Junie. Hello? I'm pleased to see you. Are you ready to work for the LSF, Mr. Trent? It's just Trent. And yeah, I'm here to see what you have to offer. Well, I found this ship for you. It's very basic and you won't have jump access yet, but it should be good enough for now. This assignment will be easy. All you have to do is babysit a convoy of food and medical supplies. You'll be hooking up with the escort CO King. I'll tell him to expect you. That is, of course, if you're interested. Sounds good. I'm in. Good. Better get going. I'll have your ship moved immediately. All you'll have to do is go to the landing pad and launch. King will be waiting for you near the docking ring in space, okay? I'll see you when you get back. Thanks.
must be Trent. I'm King, the CO of this mission. I contacted the lead transport of the convoy. They've completed pre-launch checks and are ready to go. Should be an easy run from here to Fort Bush, and then on to Pittsburgh. Ready? It's good to meet you, King. Is that a Rhineland cruiser? That's the Donau, Admiral Schultz's flagship. He's visiting Manhattan to attend a high-level meeting with President Jacoby. Keep your distance. Newark Station, this is RNC Donau, requesting clearance to dock with your station. Over. Affirmative, Donau. You are cleared for docking point six. Liberty welcomes you and Admiral Schultzky. Donau, be advised, we're picking up unknown contacts. Advise caution. Understood, Newark. All escorts, power up weapons. Affirmative. Ready to engage. Roger. Tracking incoming ships. Unidentified ships. This is Newark Station. You are entering restricted space. Alter course at once or we will open fire. Newark, do not interfere. We're here to protect the President. Shulsky is a traitor. All escorts open fire. Red alert. The Donau is hit. Launch all rescue and defensive units. All other fighters engage enemy ships. Oh my god. Damn it. They blew up the door now! Newark, this is LSF Patrol Gamma 6. Engaging enemy! Confirmed, Gamma 6. The order will pay for this. Echo playing fire at will. Understood. Targeting all enemy ships. Trent, we can't let them get away. Engage the enemy! Newark! We need reinforcements! Interceptors are en route. The Colorado and its escort are inbound. Return to normal duty, but stay alert. Trent, there's nothing more we can do here. The transports are waiting at Fort Bush. I've uploaded a waypoint to your neural net. Just fly toward it. Acknowledged, SAR. Return to base. Go to. I can't believe it. How did they get this close to Manhattan without being detected? First Freeport 7. Now this, it's getting out of control. All right, we've reached the trade lane. Engaging activation sequence. Trent, you go first. Sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. This is it, Trent. This is one of the major arteries through Manhattan's space. We're only taking it as far as Fort Bush. If we kept going, we'd reach the jump gate to the Colorado system. Transport leader, this is LSF Patrol Gamma 6. We're here to escort you to Pittsburgh. Over. Roger, Gamma 6. This is the USV Brant. Pre-launch checks have been completed. Trent, take up a position near the transport. Use the formation maneuver to link up with the convoy. Check. This is transport leader. All ships are in position and we show green status. We heard the news about Schultzky. What happened? The planetary defense grid was offline and the order managed to break through. They took out the Donau with their first missile salvo. 
We never had a chance to stop them. Looked like the Order was determined to keep Shulsky from meeting the President. Hard to believe that this could happen. We better get going. Let's hope for the best. Several convoys have come under attack in recent weeks. The rogue problem has gotten out of control in this area. Don't worry. That's why we're here. Activation sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. Looking good so far. Alert! Trade lane disruption detected. Formation cross. Damn it! Trent, get your weapons ready! This could get rough! There! Rogues! Trent, break an attack! We've got to keep them away until the trade lane comes back up! Before more of them show up. Couldn't agree more. The trade lane is back up. Let's wait. Radar shows new targets. Gamma six. We have to make a run for it. We'll cover you. This is gonna be close, but I think we can make it without another fight. Everybody, stay on course. Trent, do not engage the pirates. We have to get the convoy out of here. Everybody in one piece? Barely. That was close. Thanks for getting us here in one piece, Gamma 6. We almost didn't make it. A situation we're soon to fix. The rogues were better equipped than we expected, but we got what we came for. Thanks for playing the bait. Now it's your turn to reel him in, King. We're gonna unload our cargo. Remember our bargain. I'm transferring the payment to your neural net account. Understood. Transport leader out. Hey, King. What's going on? You'll see soon enough. Go ahead and land on Pittsburgh. I'll meet you on the surface. You'll find Pittsburgh to be remarkably unexciting, Trent. That's the mining operation. Not much to look at. A lot of rocks, smoke and fire. But what it lacks in class, it more than makes up for in cheap drinks. Set your ship down on one of the landing pads over there.
nice job, Trent. Now I believe I owe you some credits. Hey, King. Did you know it was gonna get hot out there? Mm hmm We're not done yet. We're just waiting for the others. What others? We've suspected for some time now that the Order has had ties to organized crime and liberty. They may even be hiding a secret base. I think we're on to something here, and I've called for backup. We could really use you out there, Trent. All right, but this had better be worth it. It will be. I promise you. Oh, and, uh, Trent, now that you have a little scratch, I'm looking out fitting that pile of junk you're flying. Try the equipment dealer over there. He always has good deals. I'll see you in space. SF wings from Fort Bush are searching the debris field for the rogue base. They've already taken prisoners. I'm uploading the coordinates for our search pattern. We'll rendezvous with another wing of fighters for our patrol. Hold on, there they are. Gamma 6, Delta Patrol reports no hostile contacts. Tell them to keep looking. One way or another, we'll find where those rogues are hiding. Attack on our transport. The LSF has dispatched four wings to help us track down where these rogues are coming from. They gotta have a secret base around here, and this time, we'll find it. Mayday, Mayday! This is prison ship XC-19. We're under attack. To all Liberty patrols, please respond! All units, change course to intercept. I'm uploading a waypoint. This is LSF Patrol Gamma 6. We're on an intercept course and are approaching your position. Over. Acknowledge Gamma 6. We're under attack by multiple rogue fighters. We have fires on several decks, and our defenses are failing. Understood. Hang on. search on our own. Affirmative. Good luck. I'm uploading new coordinates. Trent, take the lead.
go to. The rogue base must be around here. They'd never attack something as big as a prison ship too far away from their hideout. Mayday! This is LSF Beta 4! I'm under attack and need assistance! This is LSF Patrol Gamma 6. We hear you, Beta 4. Where are you? Over. Alright, Trent, let's take these guys out. location of the rogue base. Converge on the following coordinates. This is Alpha-1, acknowledged. We'll rendezvous at the coordinates. Over. This is Delta-1, leader. We're on the far side of Pittsburgh. Changing course to your location. Over. Wait, I've got something. Incoming rogue fighters, get ready. Trent, I read no more hostiles. Then lean into the field. Gamma-6, this is LSF Alpha-1. What's your status? The rogue base must be in the cloud ahead. Trent, take the lead. Understood. There! The rogue base! To all units, this is Gamma-6. We've confirmed the location of the rogue base. I'm transmitting new coordinates. All units, I can make out two defense platforms and an armored depot. We'll need torpedoes to take it out, over. Delta Wing is carrying torpedoes. They're on their way, Trent. We can't take out the base, their armor is too strong. But we can soften up their defenses by taking out the platforms. Let's go. Trent, look out! More pirate ships closing in fast! I hope those reinforcements get here soon. Delta-1, 
We're making our torpedo run at the station. Over. Good to see you guys. Let's finish them off. Great work back there, Trent. Not bad for a rookie. Something tells me I'm gonna be seeing a lot more of you in the future. What we did here today will hopefully put a dent in the growing cry problem we've been having in this system. Maybe now, we can focus our full attention on the Order, and anyone who supports them. Schultzky's assassination can't go unpunished. Trent, Junie just sent me a message on the secure channel. Change of plans. I need to divert. Look, if you land on Pittsburgh, talk to one of the deep space reps. They'll have something lined up for you. Meanwhile, I'm transferring your payment now. Thanks for your help. See you around. Trent, this is Junie. Good job. King just told me how impressed he was with you. Hope this wasn't too much for your first assignment. I wanted to meet up with you, but the attack on Schultzky has everyone rattled. President Jacoby's ordered a full investigation to determine what can be done about the order. It'll likely mean more work for us soon. Meanwhile, why don't you spread your wings a bit? Familiarize yourself with the New York system. Maybe see what work you can pick up. I'll be in touch. Junie out. Your request to land is granted. Proceed to land. to see you again, Trent. Well, now that we're all here, the LSF has an important mission for you. Are you interested? Yeah, sounds good. All right, here are the details. The LSF has got a line on a smuggler who's been moving artifacts in and out of Liberty Space. What sort of artifacts? Alien. The very old and fetch a huge price among collectors as high art. Liberty purposely monitors and restricts their trade, but the LSF is about to ban them altogether under orders of the President. Can I finish, please? Okay. This smuggler's name is Sean Ashcroft. He's been under investigation for a while. Now we have information that he's going to try and move a shipment into New York through the Colorado Gate. We want him. Your job is to stop the convoy before it reaches New York and bring him in for interrogation. Now he's probably got help, so be careful. I'm uploading the access code to the Colorado gate into your Neuronet now. I'll also have a scanner and tractor beam installed in your ship. Wait. Tell him about the bonus. What about the bonus? 
I've got the access codes to the rest of the Liberty Gates. You can have them once you deliver Ashcroft. Really? Really. Trent, I've got a pit stop to make. I'll see you in space. All right. you from medical do you think you're safe but you're not what are you talking about what do you think happened on freeport 7 hmm? it was blown to dust like my ship my ore ship and then my million credits that by the way you still owe me <laughs> easy come easy go no 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 we had a deal a deal that died with the station oh, that all seems so long ago now doesn't matter anyway they want us all dead who wants us all dead? Men. Government men, you know. They'll find the manifest. They'll know who was there. They're already after me. Yeah. But I'm smart. I escaped from medical. Wait, you what? You escaped? You had to. They came for me, Trent. Because of what I saw on the station. I saw what did this to us. To me. There were these ships. They weren't there. They, they weren't... Monaghan, you're not making sense. You don't understand. They know me now. I'm not safe here anymore. None of us are. Trent, we've got to get off Manhattan. I... Kill. Hey, wait, Lonigan! <laughs> hey, where do you think you're... <laughs> Wake up! Whoa. You look terrible. Are you all right? I... I don't know. What happened to you? Two men. They jumped me. Oh, my chest. Where's Lonigan? Lonigan? Who's Lonigan? They must have taken him. Trent, pull yourself together. Remember Ashcroft and the mission. Yeah, you'll be fine. Come on, Trent. We got work to do. Are you sure you're up for this? I'll be fine. Then I'll see you when you get back. Good hunting. starting to wonder if you are really okay. You are okay, aren't you? Yeah, I'm fine. Good. So what was going on down there? Who's Lonigan? I met him on Freeport 7. We just signed a deal when the station was attacked. He was injured and has been in medical ever since. I've been waiting for him to recover to get my money back. And? What did he say? Nothing about the money. He said he escaped from medical, and the people were after him. I thought he'd lost it, but then these two guys appeared and shot him. Maybe he wasn't just paranoid. Ah, I'm never getting paid. Goodbye, million credits. Hold on, we're almost at the trade lane. Our flight path takes us right past Fort Bush and straight onto the Colorado Gate. You first, Trent. Dog. Activation sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. A short 
route run from here to the Colorado gate. Let's go. Doc. Activation sequence completed. Lane jump initiated. Ever since the attack on Shulsky, the Navy has moved heavy battleships to all jump gates. Every ship going in or out of the New York system is being scanned. This is jump gate control on battleship Unity. Please identify yourselves. Over. Unity, this is Patrol Gamma 6 on special LSF assignment. Requesting permission to jump to Colorado. Over. Patrol Gamma 6, you're clear to proceed. Over. Roger that. Gamma 6 out. That wasn't too bad. Let's go. Good. Next stop, the Colorado system. System jump successful. All systems show green. Trent, take up position near the trade lane. This is Junie. Ashcroft has been sighted in the Kepler system. We don't know which way he's going, but it looks like he's coming straight at you. Keep your eyes open. Over. Acknowledged. Trent, we have to scan every ship that's coming through. Fly to the waypoint and take up position. Good. Cut your engines. We'll wait here. King, Ashcroft's convoy just entered Colorado. We've set up a trap for him at Pueblo Station. Stay where you are and make sure that none of his men get away. Over. Roger. Trent, stay sharp. ships and scan their cargo.
We're under attack! This is Patrol Gamma 6. Engaging enemy! Gamma 6, we're trapped in six hostiles. We have fires on several decks, and life support is failing. We can't take much more! Understood. Let's go, Trent. King, what is going on? Where's Ashcroft? We're on his tail. Pueblo managed to tag one of Ashcroft's ships. We're following the signal into the Silverton field. We could use some help. Understood. I'm ordering the Rio Grande to send several fighter wings. Don't do anything foolish, King. Wait for the support. Judy out. Gamma 6, this is Navy Patrol Zeta 1. Proceeding to your location. Over. drop-off point for the artifacts. This is LSF Gamma 6. We found Ashcroft. Need immediate backup. Lock onto my signal. Over. Ignore the transports, Trent. We have to take out the fighters. Gamma 6, this is Patrol Zeta-1. Ready to engage. Good to see you, Zeta-1. We're looking for a criminal named Ashcroft. We need him alive. Acknowledged. This is Zeta Leader. Engage Rogue Fighters. Ashcroft. He's fleeing into the field. I've tagged him. Trent, we can't let him get away. Come on. Damn it. Ashcroft's making a run for it. He activated his cruise engines. Firing cruise disruptor. Damn. The disruptor missile missed Ashcroft. He's entered cruise speed. We have to hurry before he can get away. Activate your cruise engines and head for the coordinates.
I'm picking up a disturbance. Could be a jump hole. We have to hurry or he's gonna get away. I'm picking something up on my scanners. Roger that. I'm seeing the same thing. Everybody, get ready. You'll be sorry you ever met. He's ejected. Trent, use your tractor beam to bring him in. Zeta-1, we're taking Ashcroft back to New York for interrogation. Thanks for your help. Don't mention it. Good job, Trent. Ashcroft's on ice and Judy's waiting for us in New York. I'm uploading a waypoint to the gate. Let's get going. I hope Ashcroft's interrogation will shed some light on the illegal artifact trade here in Liberty. Pressure from high up has been mounting in the last few weeks. Rumor has it that about a month ago, a Rhineland expedition discovered a whole new supply of these things on a distant planet in the Omicron systems. I mean, everybody knows that there are alien ruins, but they're mostly dust and the artifacts are just as dead as the beings who made them. Apparently, these new ones are different. They're active and could be dangerous. Both LSF and the Liberty Navy have stepped up their patrols, and I've heard rumors within the LSF that the President will soon be banning these artifacts altogether. Ashcroft's little party. He was getting ready to move those artifacts out of the black market when we took him down. You didn't kill him, did you? I remember the last time. Negative. Trent has him tied up in his cargo hold. He deserves worse. He'll get what he deserves, but not until he's told us all we need to know. I'll make preparations for your arrival. Be careful heading back to New York. Intel advises that members of Ashcroft's gang might try to free him before we get him into lockdown. I'm still on Manhattan. Meet me there. Juni out. Gamma 6 on special assignment. We have a prisoner for the LSF. Requesting permission to proceed. Over. Acknowledged, Gamma 6. You've received priority clearance. Over. Thank you, Unity. Out. Junie must have arranged that for us. Let's go. This is Junie. Change of plans. You and Trent are to proceed directly to the battleship Missouri near Zone 21. I'll take charge of Ashcroft there. Junie out. The Missouri? She's full of surprises. Usually the Navy draws the lines at Zone 21. They must really want to get their hands on Ashcroft. trade lane. Damn it! Intel was right! More rogues! Trent, we have to fight them off! Fort Bush, this is LSF Gamma 6. We're under attack and need assistance. Over. 
This is Fort Bush. We're launching two wings to assist you. Fort Bush Wing Alpha here. Engaging enemy. Gamma 6 on special LSF assignment. We're bringing a prisoner to LSF Commander Junko Zane. Over. Acknowledged. Commander Zane is awaiting you. Over. Roger that. Gamma 6 out. Time to collect your credits, Trent. Hold on. Yeah, I understand. Yes, I'm leaving right now. Over. Hey, Trent, a convoy near Pittsburgh is in trouble and needs help. I'll see you later. Give Junie my best. You have clearance. Dock with the battleship. Junie is... Are you sure you brought enough men? He's unconscious in my cargo hold. Trent, Ashcroft is a dangerous man, and I don't like to take unnecessary risks. Which reminds me, the bounty. And I owe you the access codes. They're both being uploaded to your Neuronet now. You'll also find an extra bonus. Thanks. You did a good job. You deserve it. What's gonna happen to Ashcroft? He'll be interrogated, of course. He's our best insight into the smuggling ring. I'm sure we can make him talk. Meanwhile, with your new security status, I suspect you'll be able to occupy your time while I'm gone. Where are you going? On assignment. I take orders too, Trent. But don't go too far. I might need you again. Soon. Stay still! I had to kill a man to escape today. What's one more? Why are you still here? Don't you see what's going on? Freeport 7? Zone 21? Yeah, the Order. No! It's not just them, it's Liberty. The artifacts. They're after something. Look, let's just talk about this. No more talking! I know what I'm doing now. I have a plan. I wanted to warn you. I felt I owed it to you. Don't try and follow me, Trent. Get out of Liberty while you still can. What the... Nice to see you again. How are things? Interesting. I'm looking for Junko Zane. Have you seen her lately? Yeah. She asked me to tell you to meet her on the terraforming station on California Minor. Anything else? No. That was all. Drink, Mr. Trent? No, thanks. I better get going. We need to talk. I was 
was with you on Freeport 7? We met on the rescue ship? Something's going on! I'm being followed. Other survivors from Freeport have disappeared. Please, meet me on Los Angeles. see me you could have picked a quieter place i'm trying to keep a low profile well this is low i'll give you that the reason i called you here trent apart from your glittering social commentary is to have you do a job ashcroft finally talked are you interested well i flew all the way out here didn't i Ashcroft's interrogation has given us a whole new perspective on the inner workings of the artifact smuggling ring. Apparently, there's someone working on the inside in Liberty. We don't know who yet. We think in the Navy, maybe even an officer. My CO has ordered a priority operation to expose this traitor. And since I need a complete outsider for this, I thought of you. Nice. So when do I leave? When do we leave? We're working together the on this one. Shh. Has now seriously crippled the order by bringing down their top man. Again, the LSF reports that the actual leader of the order, previously known only by his code name Aurelian, was shot and killed while trying to escape from Liberty into Rhineland space. In addition, Liberty officials have also just released his real name. Sam, Sam Lonigan. Lonigan. How did you know that? I met him on Freeport Seven. He was a tradesman, or at least I thought he was. He must have been doing recon before the attack. It wasn't before, it was during. He almost died. Doesn't make sense. He wasn't smart enough to be a terrorist, let alone lead them. He was trying to tell me something. Sam Lonigan, also known as Aurelian, leader of the terrorist group The Order, was apprehended today at the Liberty border. Well, whoever he was, he's dead now. Come on, Trent. We got another scumbag to ferry out. There you are. I'm switching to a secure channel. Time to find out if there really is a traitor behind the artifact smuggling. We'll take the trade lane to San Diego. You first, Trent. Let's go. Dog. The LSF took out a criminal hideout in Magellan, based on information I got out of Ashcroft. We found hundreds of artifacts. The convoy we're escorting is bringing them to the LSF research lab here in California. The existence of the convoy has been kept secret, and only a selected few know about its cargo and destination. If Ashcroft is telling the truth, and there really is a traitor working inside the Liberty military or the LSF, this will lure him out. It's simply too good to pass up. This is Liberty Border Station, San Diego. Please identify yourself. LSF Commander Junko Zane. We're here on special assignment to escort a convoy to Research Station Willard. Acknowledged, Commander. The convoy has already left and is waiting at the Borera Passage. Hold on, we're uploading a waypoint to your neural net. Got it. Thank you, San Diego. Trent, we've got to hurry. Let's go. Transport HX-17. This is Commander Zane. Sorry we're late. What's your status? All systems are green. We're ready to enter the passage. Acknowledged. Let's go.
entrance to the pathway, Commander. Transport leader, proceed to the first buoy. Acknowledged. Proceeding to first buoy. Everybody stay alert. Commander, we've reached the first buoy. Continue to the next buoy and keep your eyes open. the second buoy. Proceed to the third. There's an opening in the passage and an abandoned supply depot coming up. Keep your eyes open. Proximity alert! Scanner is picking up something! Where? What is it? A mine! Damn it! Alert! I have multiple inbound contacts coming in from all around us. They're everywhere. I read them, transport leader. San Diego, we are under attack. Repeat, we are under attack and need assistance. Over. Commander Zane, this is Gamma-1 from San Diego. Gamma-1, we need your help. Engage the enemies. Acknowledged. Engaging. positions. We're not too far away from Willard. Acknowledged. section of the Barrera Passage. Willard Station is very close. I'm glad you showed up, Gamma-1. It was starting to look grim. We got here as soon as we could. This is Willard Station. Identify yourself. This is LSF Commander Zane. We're escorting a supply of classified materials to Willard Station. Understood. We've been expecting you. Proceed to the station. Docking ports are currently offline. We'll have it fixed in a moment. Thanks again. Trent, I have to land on the station and contact a few people. It's pretty obvious now that there's a mall in the Navy. I'll see you soon. Commander Zane, you are now cleared to land. Docking ports 2 and 3 are ready for you. Dock. Dock. Oh, I recommend you land and get yourself some equipment. We'll meet back in space in a few minutes. Dock. Jack, your request to dock is granted. Please proceed to dock 2.
Alpha 1 1. This is Willard Research Station. Everything's go for launch. Good luck out there. Dread, we have to fly back to California Minor. We'll take a shortcut this time. I'm uploading the coordinates. Let's go. Switching to a secure channel. Something's terribly wrong. I wanted to brief my CO on what happened with the convoy, but he's been ordered to Manhattan. My contacts tell me that he's actually been placed under arrest for treason. I tried to find out more, but all my friends at LSF headquarters seem to have disappeared. The only person I was able to contact was King, who's still in Pittsburgh. Hold on. Radar shows several ships on an intercept course. Wow. What are Rhineland Valkyries doing here? Attention, Rhineland Vessels. This is Commander Zane of the Liberty Security Force. Please identify yourselves. Over. Rhineland Vessels, please respond. Trent, stay alert. Something's wrong here. They're opening fire. Engage! in the middle of Liberty? Why did they attack us? Do you think this had anything to do with the artifacts? I just don't get it. Rhineland. Even if there's a traitor in the Liberty military, what do Rhinelanders have to do with anything? We have to get to California Minor and talk to Walker. He's the captain of a Liberty Navy cruiser stationed here in California. He and I worked together on several operations in the past. I know we can trust him. All right, Trent, I'm going to find Walker. Meet me in the bar in a few minutes. Dog. Acknowledged. Stand by. Pattern is full. You will be clear to proceed when it's free. Trent, over here. This place is starting to feel like home. Trent, meet Marcus Walker. He's the captain of the Liberty Cruiser. He's just agreed to help us. Always happy to help out the LSF. I've known Junko for years. Sorry to hear about your luck on Freeport 7. You were fortunate to get out alive. So I've been told. Seems nowadays, if it isn't smugglers, it's the Order or some other scum trying to take advantage of us. Piracy is running rampant. Uh, you know, Trent, the Liberty military is always looking for good pilots to join them full-time. It's a worthy cause. Thanks, but no thanks. Causes come and go. I think I'd rather just keep freelancing if it's all the same to you. Suit yourself. Uh, now, if you'll excuse me, I need to make preparations. Nice meeting you, Trent. I'll see you at the rendezvous. See you in space, Trent.
Walker and his cruisers are standing by on the far side of the planet. Let's go. CO is in prison. There's been a major shakeup in the higher ranks of the LSF. That's only the tip of the iceberg. We were just attacked by Rhineland Valkyries. What? Rhinelanders? King, we're almost at our rendezvous point. I'll contact you once we're on Willard Station. Okay, I'll try to find out what's going on. Talk to you soon. There you are. I'm switching to a private channel. Junie, I just received new orders from High Command. My group has been ordered back to Space Dock for an inspection. We're supposed to depart in half an hour. Did they give any reasons? They claim that there are inconsistencies in our maintenance records. Not sure why. We had a complete workup only two months ago. This is Research Station Willard. We're under attack and are taking heavy damage. We won't be able to hold out much longer. Repeat, this is Station Willard. We're under attack. Forget about Space Dock. All ships go to battle stations. Set course for Station Willard. Station Willard, this is Liberty Cruiser Attack Group South, Captain Walker speaking. We're en route to your location and we'll be in range within a few minutes. What is your status, over? We're being attacked by Rhineland gunboats and a wing of attack fighters. Several torpedoes have hit the Harmony and the station is on fire. Automatic defenses are failing and our fires are being shot down like flies. Understood, Willard. Try to hold them back until we get there. Attack Group South. We're entering the asteroid field and we'll be at your location shortly. Acknowledge. Two more torpedoes have hit the station. We've got plasma leaks in multiple sections. Hurry! Good God. What a sight. All fighter wings, engage the enemy. Cruisers, break formation and protect Willard Station. Acknowledged. Trent, watch yourself. This is gonna get rough.
gunboats are out of it. Junko, I'll have to stay here and deploy repair teams. Why don't you join me in the station and we can discuss what's going on with the LSF and the Navy. Okay. Trent, this'll take some time and you've gone beyond the call of duty already. I'm transferring your payment now. I recommend that you take on a few jobs in the meantime. Once I know more, I'll contact you again. Right now, I need to find out what's going on. What's going on? Over here. Hey, what's wrong? Nothing. Something. I don't know yet. What do you mean? Ashcroft's missing. He was on a Liberty Dreadnought in a maximum security cell surrounded by armed guards. Trent, you don't escape from that. After our last assignment, I had a few more questions for him about his Rhineland connection. When I got there, he was gone. Who would transfer him without telling He you? wasn't transferred. Every record of him being arrested was wiped clean. Even the guards were changed. They say they never even heard of Sean Ashcroft. What do you think's going on? I, I don't know, but there's more. Walker. He's gone, too. Walker's gone? But he's the captain of a naval cruiser. Ship captains just don't go missing without someone noticing. Neither do their ships. It's listed as lost. Five years ago. Five years ago? That's impossible. People around us are disappearing, Trent. Well, we're here. What's our move? We have to find out what's going on. The last place Walker's ship was stationed was California. Somebody must have seen him. That's where we'll start. Are you with me? When do we leave? In a few minutes. I need to finish up some business inside first. Watch yourself. Keep an eye on our ships, all right? Mr. Trent, it's very important that you and I speak. And why is that? Because we're the last two. Last two what? Freeport Seven survivors, Mr. Trent. You and I are the last ones in Liberty. Everyone else is either dead or missing. Wait, I know you. From the rescue ship. What happened out there? They were looking for something. I'm a thief, Mr. Trent. I came to Freeport 7 to deliver something that a certain party wanted very badly. Apparently, they weren't alive. You're telling me this is all because of you? It's not really about me, Mr. Trent. It's about this. This is what they're after. And now they're after us. We need to get as far away from here as possible. Hold it right there! Get your hands whoa, up! Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can explain. I have my orders. All artifact smugglers are considered enemies of the state and are to be shot on sight. Free, soldier. 
I am an agent with the Liberty Security Force. This man is a freelancer who is working with me on assignment. I found him dealing in illegal artifacts. Then arrest him. What? I'm afraid I can't do that. Soldier, you are bound by Liberty Code to uphold the law. You don't have a choice. If he's a suspect, take him into custody. The law protects him and ensures a fair trial. Not anymore. you mean arrest him? He was gonna kill us both. Who is that? I don't know, but he had the right idea. Liberty isn't safe for us right now. We've gotta leave. Trent, no! What about Walker? We won't be any good to Walker if we're dead. Do you see this man? I don't think he's alone. Junie, we need to stick together and we need some time and distance to sort this out. I know a place. Follow me. The Navy will lock down all trade lanes. We have to hurry. This is the cut your engines and prepare to be taken into custody. Contact him. Damn, they've blocked the Fort Bush trade lane? Come on, we've got to get out of here now. We have to get to West Point. It's the only way out. The Unity's blocking the entrance. We're surrounded. Trent, I don't think we can get out of this. Hostile and lost on. to attack position. Bogey in sight. I'm picking up additional hostiles coming in from Manhattan. There's just too many of them. I'm sorry. Junie, this is King. Proceed to West Point. King! Walker here. We'll take care of the battleship. All hands, fire at will. I repeat, all hands, fire at will. Positions. We're heading straight for the old trade lane to Ithaca Station. Hostile fighters detected. They're closing fast. Here they come. Several wings of Navy fighters. We'll provide you cover. Understood. Quickly, Trent. We've got to get to the Badlands. You take point. Lambda 4 is down. Quick. 
Lambda 5 has been destroyed. We have to get out of here, now! Stop. We made it. The Badlands will shield us from their scanners. I don't think the Navy will follow us in here. Damn it. That was close. I think we managed to shake him. Thanks for getting us out of there. It started to look grim. Thank Walker. When he told me that Trent's name showed up on the Navy's most wanted list, I knew you were in trouble. What? He's wanted for murder, artifact smuggling, treason, and the destruction of Freeport 7. Quite an impressive list, actually. Look, I have to rendezvous with Walker near Detroit. Stay low for a while. I'll be in touch. Trent, I've uploaded new coordinates. You're gonna meet a friend of mine. Take point. Go to. Go to. Approaching ships. This is a restricted area. Turn around at once. Dr. Van Pelt. This is Junko. Junko Zane. Junie, is this you? I've heard the news about you on the secure channel. What is going on? Too long to explain. We need a place to hide. You are cleared to dock. I'll meet you on the deck. Dock. Junie. Oh, I'm glad you made it. The Secure Channel is buzzing with reports about you. This is Trent. Van Pelt's my name, young man. Welcome. We just need to lay low for a while. Well, you've come to the right place. The only visitor I get is a supply ship once a month. If you don't mind my asking, what are you doing this far out? Studying the anomalies in the Badlands. This station you see around you was part of a, a grand experiment to fuel Liberty's waning resources. Eh, that was long before the gas mining guild, of course. I never heard about that. Nor would you. There was an accident here. Liberty doesn't like to publicize its failures. It was abandoned. Except for me, of course. You're here all alone? Except for the machines. I like it that way. Not a lot of distress. To all Liberty bounty hunters and peacekeeping forces, be advised there is a bounty for two suspects wanted for questioning. Sending identity data now. They're armed and extremely dangerous. End transmission. Junie, what is all this about? I think it has something to do with this. Clearly an artifact. But I've never seen anything like it. Freeport 7 was destroyed for it. The man who had it was killed in front of me. We were almost next. Well, it's very ancient. Rarified. Adnium crystal setting. Still active. Hmm. You might try Quintain. What, Doctor? Not what, dear. Who? Professor Roland Quintain of Cambridge. I can't help you with this, but he might. He's a respected xenoarchaeologist. I don't understand. Help us what? Why, identify it. I don't want to identify it. I want to get rid of it. We can't get rid of it now. There's a reason all this is happening, and we're in the middle of it. At least, if we keep it, we have a bargaining chip. <sighs> I'm afraid your young man is right, my dear. Oh, this is just great. Don't worry. You'll both be safe in Britonium. Now, how to get you there? Liberty ships approaching. Long range scan shows a Liberty patrol. They must have followed you somehow. They never come out this far. So much for laying low. I'm setting the automatic defense systems to cover you. Take the back way. What back way? 
One of the things that was left behind here was a jump gate to Magellan. No one has used it since the disaster, but it still works. It's deep in the Badlands. I'm loading up the coordinates for you now. What about you? I'll be fine. Take care of yourself. Good luck, young man. Thank you. I... I don't know. You must go. Now. Come on. Steer right where you are. You are in violation of Liberty Security Code and are subject to immediate termination. Liberty Patrol, this is Benford Station. These people are here under my authority. Negative, Benford. Target renegade ships on my signal. Oh my god, Ben Pelt! Fire! No! Come on, Trent, we gotta help him! Cuny, get clear! The defense system will hold them off. We're not leaving you! Ships, cease fire! 
These two are under the protection of the lane hackers. Negative. Those two have a big bounty on their heads. Clear out. There's no bounty for hackers. You leave us no choice. All ships, open fire! What the... Are you crazy? You'll pay for this. Trent, I need your help. Please come back here. nearby that lead to Manchester and Leeds. Leeds? My friend Tobias runs the equipment dealership there. The bad news is that Liberty has dramatically stepped up their policies against illegal artifacts. Rumors speak of hundreds of arrests, and there's a reward on our heads. One million credits. Can you believe it? The artifact is the key. We have to find out what it is and why they want it so badly. Alert! Unknown contacts are closing in fast. Launch all fighters. Picking up at least four Ryland heavy fighters. Man all turrets. Rhinelanders again. They're here for the artifact. Trent, engage! Hand over the artifact and you will be spared. Target the leader. The command center is hit! Got one! Every bounty hunter in the colonies is going to be after us. I'll go to Cambridge to find Professor Quintain. Trent, find your friend on Leeds and stay out of sight. I'm uploading the coordinates of the Leeds jump hall. I'll contact you when I reach Cambridge. Good luck, and be careful.
contacted me. He's with Walker. He said the Navy has been placed on heightened alert. Don't Jacoby see. has classified all artifacts as illegal. And congratulations. You and I are now Liberty's most wanted criminals. Take on a few jobs and try to get a new ship. I'll contact you when I find Quintain. Judy out. Cambridge. No luck so far finding the professor. I'll contact you when I hear anything. Until then, keep a low profile. Every bounty hunter in the colonies is probably looking for us. Sorry with that one, let me tell you. You can trust Richard Winston Tobias to make you the best deal anywhere. I was wondering when you might come back. Are you in some kind of trouble? You might say that. <laughs> you might also say I told you so. I didn't take the time to apprentice you so you could throw it all away on some fool scheme. But you knew better. The deal of a lifetime, you said, remember? Eh? Now look at you. At your hunk of junk on the landing pad? Yeah. Hmm. I suppose you'll be wanting some new parts of that thing. It's good to see you, boy. So are you back now? For good? It's complicated, Tobias. Seems like all of Liberty is after me. I see. Well, the first thing to do is get rid of your ship. There's likely to be a description note on it. That'll make you a popular target for bounty hunters. You'll be needing something that blends in better around. I want you to go and see the ship dealer in New London. I'll tell him you're coming. He'll have a ship for you. I don't think I have the credits for that. For once, just do what I tell you, boy. I've been putting some aside. You'll have enough. Come with me. I was wondering when you'd show. Did you find Quintain? That's the thing. The good doctor has disappeared. You mean like the others? No, not like them. This one left a trail, but I'm gonna need your help, Trent. Are you with me? That's why I'm here. Count me in. Good. What do you know about Xenoarchaeology? Not much. Why? Just let me do the talking. And whatever you do, keep that artifact out of sight. I don't want to repeat performance of Manhattan. Anything else? Yeah. Bring the bottle. Very nice of you to see us on such short notice, Mr. Vance. When you said in your message that you and Dr. Trent were from the Hammer Research Institute in Liberty, I could hardly refuse. It's not entirely unusual for Dr. Quintain to miss an appointment now and then. Even one regarding funding. We understand. We'd made it quite a while ago. I'm just pleased the university put me in touch with you. I do a lot of work for Dr. Quintain, shuttling people and equipment back and forth to his research sites. 
And I'm sorry, usually I can find him, but... You mean you don't know where he is? He doesn't know where he is. Ouch. Oh, he hasn't been around for weeks. Probably doing deep research. He doesn't always tell us. Dr. Sinclair doesn't even know where he is. Have you spoken to her yet? No. She's been doing field work for the professor for years. Has she? Do you think she'd mind if we looked her up? No. Funding is what these scientists live for. Well, that and a little recognition, of course. Of course. Can you tell us where Dr. Sinclair is now? Sprague. I'm afraid I can't get her a message, though. It's too far out. That's all right. We'll go to her. You've been very helpful, Mr. Vance. Thank you. I think Dr. Sinclair will be quite pleased. Last week, nothing. This week, you and the Rhinelanders. What Rhinelanders? From the New Berlin Museum. They're also very interested in their work. You just missed them. Uh-oh. We gotta move. Get whatever you need here on Cambridge and meet me in space. Don't take too long, Doctor. I won't. <laughs> Academics. ago. We have to get to Sinclair before they do. I checked the star chart. Sprague is a remote planet in the Omega-3 system. It's not too far from here. Maybe this Dr. Sinclair is all we need to find out more about our artifact. that you are traveling to the Omega systems. Be advised that tensions between the Bretonian Empire and Rhineland have escalated. A military confrontation cannot be ruled out. Roger, Norfolk. Our destination is Sprague and Omega-3. We have no intention to enter Rhineland territory. Understood. We have no reports of Rhineland activity in that system. Norfolk out. Hold on. We'll take this trade lane. You lead, Trent. Dog. conflict with Rhineland is about the damn alien artifacts. Did you hear that President Jacoby is now trying to persuade the Queen to ban all artifacts here in Bretonia? I'm sure she has her reasons. There's the jump gate. You first, Trent. Sprague is an unpopulated planet with no trade lane connections. We'll have to fly from here to Freeport 1 and then through open space.
we have to leave the trade lane. Incoming ships! Be advised! Rhineland forces have set up blockades in Omega-7. No ships are allowed access to Rhineland space. All merchant vessels are to remain at Freeport 1 until the crisis is over. Freeport 1, we're on our way to Sprague to bring supplies to an archaeological expedition. Have you detected any Rhineland ships in the area? Negative, but Sprague lies beyond our patrol routes. If you are attacked, we won't be able to send help. Understood. Thanks for the warning. Trent, I've uploaded the coordinates to Sprague into your neural net. Come on. Go to... The situation is really getting out of control now. A blockade in Omega-7? Rhineland is now in direct violation of the Borman Treaty. The colonies haven't been this close to an open military conflict since the 80-year war between Rhineland and the GMG. Vance gave me the frequency of the dig site beacon. I'm not picking up a signal yet. We probably have to get closer. Almost there. Still no signal. We made it. You duck first, Trent. Let's hope for the best. 
Maybe they're all digging for artifacts and don't even know we're coming. Do you think we're too late? We have to find Sinclair and get the hell out of here. And you say you got this where exactly? A thief on Manhattan. He was killed because of it. Now those same people are after us. We were told you could help. Look around you, Miss Zane. You are standing in the living history of the Dom Kavash, a race that predates early man by over 10 million years. Up until recently, relatively speaking, they were the inhabitants of much of our new home here in Sirius. I've been working for years to piece together fragments of their past, their culture, technology, language, anything. These panels here have been the core of my research. They've shed light on some of their writings, but thanks to this piece, I'm close to unlocking their code. Yes, I know quite a lot about this artifact, but not why anyone would want to kill for it. Know anything about cloaking Rhineland ships? Mr. Trent, I am a scientist. I deal in facts, not fiction. Well, you better listen to the facts. A lot of people have died because of this trinket. There's something going on in the colonies. People are being killed. Others have disappeared, like your colleague, Dr. Quintain. Quintain hasn't disappeared. He's a recluse. He's gone under, that's what I think. And a man like him only goes under for a very good reason. I think he knew too much. This is ridiculous. Is it? We find out that Rhineland has an active interest in your research, and when we get here, we're attacked by Rhineland ships using a technology I have never seen before. Still not enough of a connection for you? How about that friends of mine, trusted people in the Liberty military assigned to stop illegal artifact smuggling, are gone, like they were never there. Maybe they knew too much, too. They just didn't see it coming like Quintain. Well, I do, and you should, too. And with him gone, that only leaves you. I figure those ships are coming back here soon and there's no telling what else they're bringing with them. You, Doctor, can either be a live scientist on the run or a dead one in the ground. Which will it be? I'm not leaving without my work. Besides, how do I know you aren't the enemy? Doctor, we've got over a dozen ships on our screen. I don't know what kind. We didn't see them coming. I told you they were coming back. Pack up what you can and send the others to the ships. Yes, Doctor. All right, I'm with you. Come on, we've got to go. Doctor, the panels have been loaded into Mr. Trent's hold. Good. Get clear while you can. They'll tear this place apart. Come on!
is it. We should land here. Keep your eyes open, they can't be that far off. I think we've managed to shake them for now. I hope you're right. Do you ever get tired of this? The running and fighting? No, this. Tell you the truth, I don't even pay attention anymore. It's a view like this that got me into xenoarchaeology in the first place. I thought, if the universe exists for eons, but I could only experience it for a brief moment of time, I wondered what a more ancient race must have thought of it. I wanted to live through them. If you're right and Quintain has hidden himself, that means he's still out there somewhere. What's that? They found us! We've got to get out of here! Where? Where are we going? The leads. I have a friend there. Come on. The station is exploding! We can't outrun them this time. Trent, engage! of the artifact, we've been hunted. First by the Liberty Navy, and bounty hunters, now Rhinelanders. Everybody seems to be after it, and we don't even know what it is. A friend told us that Professor Quintain might be able to shed some light on this. And Quintain has disappeared? His lab was destroyed. The only lead we could find was your pilot, Vance. He told us where to find you. There's the jump hole. Trent, you go first. We have 
to head to New London and from there to Leeds. I doubt the Rhinelanders will look for us here, but we need to stay sharp. Trent, take the lead. Head for the new coordinates. We need to know what's going on with this artifact. Why well, everyone's after it. No idea. I found it on planet Pygar and knew immediately that it was of great archaeological significance. I was scheduled to fly to Cambridge to get Professor Quintain's expert opinion. But then the artifact was stolen and I didn't even go to Cambridge. I actually haven't seen the Professor in years. Damn. I guess the best thing we can do is fly to Leeds and regroup. Break an attack! 
That was it. Let's get out of here. Mr. Trent, you go first. Doc. in Rhineland, and I'm afraid the worst is yet to come. We'll fly to the Norfolk and give ourselves up. Hopefully someone in the Bretonia military will believe our story. Good luck to you. The trade lane to Leeds is near. We should go. Who are we meeting on Leeds? An old friend of Trent's. This will be interesting. Richard Winston Tobias Esquire, dear lady. Tobias sort of, uh, raised me. And from such humble beginnings, your head grew to its present size? We're all clear. Nobody followed us. Good. And who do we have here? Another girl? <laughs> Tell me, boy, what have you been doing? Tobias, we need a safe place to lay low for a while. Doctor, can you decipher the writing on the artifact? I can do most of it, but not alone. I need Quintain. Damn. Like it or not, Trent, if we're gonna get some answers, I think we're gonna have to find Quintain. I knew you were gonna say that. Look, this may take some time. Sinclair will do everything she can with her work, and I'll dig around for any leads on Quintain. You try and scare up some business, we could probably use the credits. Anyway, I can't have you lounging around here like a big ox waiting for things to happen. What? I can't remember when I ever saw such a vision of love. Oh, brother. I'm looking for a guy named Dexter Hovis. Have you seen him? Yeah! 
you Dexter Hovis? I'm Hovis. I'm a friend of Quintain's. I understand you do some work for him every now and then. I've got you know, I'd love to spend all day John with you, Bretonian, but I really only talk to racers. Unless, of course, you are a racer and you're looking for a challenge. Say, me, perhaps. In that case, I'll talk to you all day. Providing, of course, you live. You see, I have a hard time finding people who race against me. What do you say, Tenderfoot? You're on. Good, I'll meet you outside. We have a challenger. His name is Trent. Against our very own Dexter Holders. Place your bets. Make it quick. <laughs> I was beginning to think you were scared. Not a chance. I said I'd race you. Here I am. <laughs> I like your attitude, Bretonian. It'll be a shame to see you burn, but hey, that's the price of sportsmanship. I may surprise you, Hovis. We'll see soon enough, won't we? Welcome, racers. You have selected a one-lap race. Do you need a review of the regulations? Of course I don't, you hunk of junk. I built this damn thing, but its memory banks are busted. Simple rules, Bretonian. One round. No shooting or bumping, and if you stink it up or chicken out on the course, you'll make me angry. And you don't want that. You ready? Racers on your marks. Three. Two. Tony and I haven't felt a challenge in years. Now tell me about Quintain. Is he here? Here? No. He contacted me to take him even further into the asteroid field to an abandoned mining station called the Glorious. He's holed up with the pirates that took it over. He said he needed to disappear for a while. But naturally, you didn't hear any of this from me. Naturally. Now how do I get there? Take the old trade lane into the asteroid field. But be careful. The lane isn't stable. Sometimes the asteroids can get through. And watch out for a group of Rhinelanders that was headed that way. They didn't look too friendly. Did they race? Ha, no. They're too yellow. 
Hey, Bretonian, if it don't work out, you know, you can always come back and race with us. Freelancer Alpha 1-1, this is the hood. You are cleared for launch. Good luck out there. Go to... with that. You fought well out there. Come on. Someone wants to have a look at you. <laughs> Dr. Quintain. And who are you? The name's Trent. Dr. Sinclair sent me to find... I find you. that hard to believe, since she has no idea where I am. Now, who sent you? I already told you. Enough! You do understand that with the appearance of our Rhineland friends, I'm hesitant to take too many chances. But I fought them too. Yes, and I wanted to thank you for your help. Push him out of the airlock. Wait, wait! I have the Dom Kavash artifact. What did you say? I have your artifact. The one Sinclair lost on Pygar. I found it. That's why I came. Right. 
don't suspect you have it with you. No, that would be too easy. So where is it, then? Sinclair's working on it back on Leeds in hiding. But she can't decipher it on her own. She needs your help. Very well, Mr. Trent. I will go back with you, but on one condition. What's that? That we not go alone. All right. Mr. Trent, Quintain here. I'm flying this armored transport. I know it's slow, but it contains all the equipment I need for my work. I think we're in luck. The intermittent jump hold leads is phase aligned right now. We should be able to take it safely. I'm uploading the coordinates. Mr. Trent, you take point. So Sinclair wants to meet on leads? That blight on our culture? All right. It's an ambush! I'm hit! My cruise engines are down! Perez and Wallace, protect Quintain. Mr. Trent, let's take down the gunship. Thank <laughs> you. 
get out of here. First, and we'll follow you through. We'll be at Planet Leeds before you know it, Professor. We should be safe now. Let's get back on solid ground. Mr. Trent, you have the coordinates to lead. Take point. I actually haven't seen Dr. Sinclair in years. She sent me a message a while back that she had made a discovery on Pygon. Finally, a Dom Kavosh artifact that's still active. Wonderful doing business with you. Good night. Tobias. Here. Who's this then? This is Dr. Quintain. He's a professor. Him? No. Oh, what field? I'll have you know, sir, I am the foremost authority on Xenoarchaeology. Oh, I'm sure you are. <laughs> come on, Mr. Wizard. I expect you've come to see the missus. Quintain! Damn it, I am mad as hell at you. What happened? Where have you been? I had to go away, Kendra. Not long after you made your discovery, things began to happen. People around me started to go missing. Then I came back one night to find my lab turned upside down and noticed I was being followed. By whom? A man named Cress. He told me I was on a list, that my work had put me in great jeopardy. I left that night and didn't look back. So, you see, I couldn't tell anyone. Especially you. I thought you'd become a target as well. She already is. We all are. Because of this. This is it? May I? It's magnificent. Yes, it is. But it's obviously part of something more significant. It's time you and I figured out what that is. Look, I hate to rush this reunion along. Someone's here. I'll take care of it. Hello, my friends. What is it I can get for you today? We are looking for a man. We have reason to believe he's in the area. Is it you, Chad? Sorry, I haven't seen him. He is considered an enemy of Rhineland. Anyone caught hiding him would face severe consequences. Listen to me. You are not in Rhineland now, you're in my shop. I've already told you the man you're looking for isn't here, so unless you'd like an education in foreign policy that you won't soon forget, I suggest you move along. Now! We can be patient, Mr. Tobias. Rest assured, we won't be far. No. I'm sure you won't be. It's just a matter of time before they'll be back. She's right. Now that they've got your scent, it's not safe here anymore. Cress. The night he came, he offered me a place to hide in the border worlds. Maybe now is a good time to take him up on it. But do you trust him? I'd rather take my chances with him than those Rhineland agents. We need you now, Trent. Ready?
All right, let's go. Now I want you to get clear of this place for a while. I'm not going to be... Just until this blows over. I'll be back when I can. Take care of yourself, old man. There you are. Trent, do you think Tobias will be all right? Maybe he should come with us. Tobias is better off far away from us. As long as we have the artifact, none of us will be safe. We'll be lucky to get out of here in one piece. We should take the trade lane to Stokes, and from there we'll jump to the Tau 31 system. We don't have any time to waste. Let's go. out of leads are blocked. What do we do? We fight. We're coming up on Stokes. Stay sharp.
Get ready. Oh my god! A Rhinelander cruiser is blocking the gate! We don't stand a chance! This is the end. You have nowhere else to run. Give up! Now! Trent, engage the cruiser. Try to knock out their turrets. You fools! You will be destroyed! There are no ships around here. Outpost Holman, please come in. Something is very wrong here. It's a trap. We only have one chance. Quick, let's get out of here. Tobias, we'll hold them off. Get these people to safety. Run! 
Thank you, my friends. Dark denied. This is the trade lead to the new Tau-23 gate. It's under construction on this end, but we should be able to use it. Artifact? It could be. 
We need to find a safe haven and perform a thorough analysis of the object. Hard to believe it all hinges on a message to some bartender. I hope this Cress wasn't playing games. We're setting a trap. Almost at Shinkaku. Docking. I will land and talk to the bartender. We should all land to make repairs and rearm ourselves. Trent, you go first. Docking not allowed. Roger that. Your request to dock is granted. Please proceed to dock two. System. The bartender gave me a set of coordinates. I'm uploading them now. My friends, I will take my leave from you now. If there is indeed a war coming between Rhineland and Bretonia, I am needed at home. I understand. Thank you for everything, Tobias. We will meet again, I promise. Trent, get these people to safety, and find out what this artifact of yours is all about. Good luck to all of you. All right, everybody. Let's get moving. We have to be careful. The bartender warned me that Rhineland ships have been sighted in the area. He suggested that we fly through the methane field. It should mask our engine signatures. What did the bartender say about Cress? Not much. He told me that Cress frequently operates in this area, and then he gave me these coordinates. That's all. Unfortunately, the field will only provide us with cover for half of the way. After that, we'll have to fly through open space. We're at the edge of the field. From now on, we're without cover. So far, radar is clear. Oh my god. Looks like the whole damn Rhineland fleet. This is the Rhineland battleship Schiller. Cut your engines and deactivate your weapon system. Prepare to be boarded. We can't win this, Trent. I'm picking up new contacts coming in very fast. Professor Quintain, Colonel Cress sent us to help you. Cress, how did you know? No time to explain. We're uploading coordinates. Professor, you and the freighter have to fly there as quickly as you can. We'll try to hold off the Rhineland fleet. To all ships, we have unidentified targets on an intercept course. All fighter wings, break and attack. Moving to intercept. This is Razor Leader. Concentrate your fire on the heavy cruiser. Roger that. Red alert! The Schiller is hit! Man all turrets! All other fighters! Engage enemy ships! We're locked on. Quintain escorts. We could use your help. Engage the Rhineland ships. We have to buy the Professor time to get away. Incoming! Bullseye! All units engage! Hit them fast and hit them hard! All hands to emergency stations! Razor 2, engaging. Razor 3, we're going in. Giving way! We're losing integrity! 
lit. All fighters, disengage and return home. Go to... Tender on Chicago contacted us. Cress immediately sent us to find you. Rhineland ships have been spotted in this system for several days now. When we heard that Quintain was on Shinkaku, we knew he'd likely run into trouble. We were getting worried. We should be safe now, but we need to keep moving. The jump hole to Tau 23 is near. Trent, I've uploaded the coordinates. Let's go. Be careful in the methane field. Certain pockets are explosive and could damage our ships. Danger. Volatile gases detected. of the outcasts. He'll be pleased to see you, Professor. There's the jump hole. Doc. System. It's fully within the barrier. Both BMM and IMG are maintaining bases here, since rich deposits of beryllium and niobium have been found. Yourselves. This is Razor One. We're bringing a visitor to Colonel Cress. We're expected. Razor One, your party is cleared to land. Okay. Professor, land on the base. Cress is awaiting your arrival. Doc. Understood. Your request to Doc is granted. Proceed to Doc Two. Quiet. We just need to find Cress. State your business. My name is Quintain. I'm here to see Cress. Colonel Cress sees no one. He'll see me. He sees no one. Don't go and do that. Now that I've got your attention, take us to see the Colonel. I think, my friend, you misunderstand your position. I'm expendable. Dr. Quintain. Cress. I'm pleased to see that you're all right after all. And you brought protection. Very wise. Please tell him to stand down. Mr. Trent. Come, Dr. Quintain. We have much to talk about. Let me offer you the sanctuary of my base. Thank you. 
We'll need a place to continue our research. We have facilities at your disposal, of course. You see, we've had our eye on Dr. Quintain and his research for quite some time. When Dr. Sinclair made her discovery, it caused quite a stir among our enemies. What enemies? The Rhinelanders? Let's just say that your enemies are our enemies. Give me a straight answer. Who do you work for, Colonel? The Order. You work for Aurelian? Despite what you may have heard, we are only interested in freedom and peace. If that's so, then why all of the attacks? <laughs> I understand your suspicion, but we are not guilty of nearly as much as your media would suggest. For now, please accept my hospitality and the spirit in which it is offered. Tell me. What else do you require of me? What if I'm right? There's something we've overlooked. We need the Proteus Tome. What's that? It's a piece of parchment that rests in the Natural History Museum in Kasari. I think it holds the answer to the artifact. It's kept in a sealed titanium cylinder in the archives. Very well. That shouldn't be difficult. We have an agent in Kasari who may be useful for this. Lord Hakira. He's a local potentate. He can arrange for its liberation. No dice, Crash. I'm going myself. You don't really trust me, do you, Mr. Trent? No. But if, as you say, your enemies are our enemies, you won't deny me this. Or me. If you're going, I'm going. Mr. Trent? Miss Zane? I was told you would be coming. I'm Lord Hakira. I am the Prefect of Honshu. Is there a problem? I'm sorry, you're just not what I expected. You expected a terrorist, then? I serve the order to help my people, Mr. Trent. I understand that you are here for the Proteus Tome. Unfortunately, that will not be easy. The artifacts in the museum have come under renewed scrutiny. I will need to secure a special permission for us to be allowed access. Lord Akira. Please excuse me. I've recently lost contact with one of my operatives in Rhineland. This may be news. I will be in touch once I get access to the Proteus Tome. That's it? What are we supposed to do now? Wait? Like hell we will. I have contacts here too. To get to them, we're gonna have to split up for a while. What am I supposed to do around here while you're gone? Yeah, you should try to fit in a little. Maybe get some work. By the sound of things, this may take a while. Don't worry. I won't be far. You came? Yeah. I was starting to wonder if we were partners anymore. I just had to dig a little deeper than I thought. Trent, I heard from Lord Hakira. He says that the Proteus Tome and all of the museum artifacts have now come under the personal control of Governor Takagi. Hakira can't help us. What do you mean? That's why we came. You have to understand Kasari customs. Hakira is a lord. His position gives him power, but it also limits him. There's only so much he can do before he violates his station. Anyway, I'm on to something, but you're gonna have to trust me on this one. If we do this, we do it together, understand? Are you in? Why not? I've come this far, haven't I? Thank you. Ozu, this is Trent, the man I told you about. Ah, Mr. Trent. Junko speaks highly of you. Please, sit. Thanks. Since Junko's departure to liberty, many things have changed here. The old ways are dying out as we become more of a melting pot of cultures. Do you understand? I think I do. The one thing that has not changed is the face of treachery. It is something that we have fought for many generations. Ozu is a lieutenant in the Blood Dragons, a counter-political group that opposes the Shogun. The reason the Blood Dragons have survived is because of our ability to adapt and change, to outmaneuver the stronger opponent. This would not be possible without carefully nurtured relationships, Mr. Trent. Which brings me to you. I am told that you and the Order seek a certain artifact. That's right. The Proteus Tome. It's fallen under the control of Governor Takagi. Yes, Takagi. He has been acting strangely, even for him, since his return from Rhineland. Our sources now say that there is a secret transport being loaded with these artifacts, bound from Takagi, back to the Chancellor. We believe the Proteus Tome is one of those on board. How much time do we have? Little. Particularly since Takagi himself may be on that transport. He's defecting? We believe so. With an offering to his new lord and master, the Chancellor. 
Our vendetta with Takagi is an old one. Unfortunately, we may have only this one last opportunity to repay him for his crimes. Mr. Trent, here is what I propose. You and the Order shall have what you desire if you help rid us of Takagi. Trent, Takagi is a traitor to his people. He deserves to die. Do us this service. Agreed. Excellent. We leave at once. Freelancer Alpha 1-1. One one. This is Shinagawa. Everything's a go for launch. Good flying. Mr. Trent, we will take the trade lane from here to the Honshu Gate. Coordinates received. Trent, take point. My sources tell me that Takagi's transport is currently docked at the Yukawa shipyard in Honshu. It is heavily guarded. Apparently they are taking additional cargo on board. Is it the town? That is very possible. Yukawa is a Kishiro base, and Takagi owns a large portion of that organization. the jump gate, Mr. Trent. Blood Dragon fighters are awaiting us at a nearby jump hole. I'm uploading the coordinates. Why are we taking a jump hole? Takagi is a powerful man, Junko. He has spies everywhere. If we want to have a chance to capture the transport, we need to take them by surprise. orders. Enter formation and follow us to the jump hole. Entering formation. Set course for the jump hole. Only three ships? The Blood Dragons are small in numbers, Junko, but they are the best fighter pilots in the colonies. Dog. Jump hole, Mr. Trent. Please go first. is still docking with Yukawa, Ozu-sensei, but it looked like they were about to leave. I counted multiple heavy weapon platforms and strong fighter protection. It won't be easy. We don't have any time to waste. Let's go. What's our plan? We have to hit them quickly and decisively. First, we target the weapon platforms and then the fighter escorts. How do we get to the transport? We have a strike force positioned on Yukawa that will seize control of the transport. Once we've eliminated the fighters, our people will fly the transport out of there. Understood. The nebula will cover us most of the way, but the final approach will be in open space. We will have to fly as fast as possible before the scanners detect us. Every second will count. the shipyard. Is everybody ready? Dragon 1, ready to engage. Dragon 2, ready. I'm ready, Ozu. Our first targets are the weapon platforms. All ships, engage! One of their fighters is down. In 
Engage the other fighters.
call to the Chukoku system. Mr. Trent, please go first. Identify yourself, or you will be destroyed. This is Lieutenant Ozu. Stand down, patrol. We have captured Takagi's transport and are escorting it back to Kyoto as ordered. Yes, Sensei. We are almost there. Junko, Mr. Trent, follow me. I have the coordinates. Trent, you take the lead. Where are we going? To Kyoto. Kyoto? Trent. That's the legendary home of the Blood Dragons. I don't know anyone who's ever seen it. Ozu, you honor us. The honor is ours. Dark. victory over Takagi and Edo. Here you shall receive what you came for. I will see you shortly. This is amazing. How long have the Blood Dragons been here in this asteroid? Several generations. But with Takagi eliminated, the Edo Shogunate is weaker, and our victory is near. Pardon me, Lieutenant. Excuse me. Tell me, how long have you known Ozu? You mean, was he always a radical in the Blood Dragons? No. When I knew him, he was to be a promising political student at the Kusari Academy. What happened? People are changed by their world, Trent. Rarely vice versa. Ozu's living proof of that. Yeah. I'm afraid we have been deceived. This was the right shipment, but we have neither the artifacts nor Takagi. He was not on the transport, as we were led to believe. Something has changed. So what do we do now? I will make the necessary inquiries. For now. I suggest that you occupy yourselves with whatever diversions we can offer. Well, I can't just sit here. Maybe the Blood Dragons could use a little help. Joining the ranks of the Radical Left? I'm not on assignment anymore, Trent. I get to see how the other side lives. You know, it wouldn't hurt you to get out there for a while, either. Maybe take some missions. From the sound of things, it may be a while. Don't worry. I'll let you know when we hear something. I'm glad you have arrived. I have news. As we feared, Governor Takagi is indeed alive. I am told that he has secretly left the palace and has moved the artifacts to his fortified retreat, a remote planetoid with many defenses. But I have come up with a plan that should get us both what we want. Shall we proceed? Okay, let's do it. Have you told Junie yet? This is for us alone, Mr. Trent. I see. Come, we have no time to waste. My attack squad is ready. I'll brief you in space. Alpha 1-1, this is Kyoto. You are cleared for launch. Good luck out there. Mr. Trent, my informants report that Takagi is preparing to leave his fortress. We have a little time. Takagi's arch is only one system away from here, in Tohoku. The Blood Dragons discovered a jump hole to there over 20 years ago. I'm uploading the coordinates. 
go to. Trent! Ozu! I heard you leaving, what's going on? We are attempting to retrieve the Proteus Tome, Junko. We're flying to Takagi's Arch. No! That's suicide! The Arch is too well defended! This is our last chance, Junko. Takagi is leaving for Rhineland. There must be another way! We have decided to attack Takagi's base with full force. We will find the Tome and kill Takagi. Wish us luck. Ozu out. Just don't get yourselves killed. We're approaching the hole now. It will bring us very close to his base. There it is, Mr. Trent. Go ahead and jump. A fighter wing is awaiting us on the other side. Report. There is a lot of activity in this system, Lieutenant. Takagi has drastically increased his patrols within the last few hours. It almost seems like he is expecting an attack. We're flying to a nearby outpost of the Blood Dragons. I'm uploading the coordinates. Mr. Trent, take the lead. We'll follow you. We have to be careful. This system is littered with hidden defense systems and patrol wings. No contacts so far. Maybe we're lucky. Apple Ryuko, this is Lieutenant Ozu. Lieutenant, we have monitored your operation and are standing by. Our forces are at your disposal. Long-range radar indicates that there are a large number of ships assembled in the area near the arch. It appears Takagi is leaving his fortress. If Takagi escapes, we'll forever miss our opportunity to retrieve the tome and end that demon's life. We have to hurry. We are uploading the coordinates of the arch into your neural net. Long live the dragons! Dragon 2, you know his base defenses. What is our best option? You and Mr. Trent should approach from beneath the base. Located there is a large cylindrical stabilizer used to reinforce the structure of the planetoid. The safest approach would be through this opening. We will attempt to occupy his forces and draw them away from the base. That should buy you enough time to break in. Hopefully unnoticed.
planetary arch. Once one of the wonders of Kusari ingenuity, now it is a fortress of deceit and evil. Dragons, proceed to the target. I am picking up several contacts. We have to destroy those ships. Engage! Radiation damage detected. Damn it! Lieutenant Ozu, make your run! We lost another ship! Ozu, you have to get into the arch now! We can't hold them back! This is Dragon One. Ready to assist. Dragon One, we must take out these gunboats at all costs. Understood. Long live the Blood Dragons. Dragons, engage! Self. Sometimes the simplest solutions are the best. The dome? There. The 
Proteus Tome. Now for Takagi. Think it will be that easy, do you? Well, as you said, sometimes the simplest solutions. Neural gas. Locked. Not for long. Stand back. <coughs> friend here have broken into my home and killed my servants to deprive me of the Proteus storm and my life. Why? Why? No, no. Keep your seat. I wouldn't want anything bad to happen to you. Not until we have had a chance to talk, Mr. Trent. Leave us. So, what's to keep me from killing you right now and taking the tome? I think I'm more than a match for the two of you. On the other hand, maybe I should even the odds. Oh. Oh. Ozu! Be sure, Mr. Trent. Do you really know with whom you are dealing? You are going to tell me what I want to know. About the tome, the order, everything.
should set them back for a while. We have to get the hell out of here. Come on. Wait. Where's Ozu? He didn't make it. He sacrificed his life to end Dekagi's reign. How? He was killed by a nomad. We only know a few things about them. They are a species with the ability to possess humans and have been slowly infiltrating the colonies. It appears that they are mostly targeting high-ranking government and military officials. Tekagi was one of these people. Up until today, no one had ever seen a nomad and lived to talk about it. We can talk about this more later. I will explain when we are in Chugoku. We've reached the jump hole. And Mr. Trent, please go first. Docking not allowed. Dock. is going on. Go to. How long have you known about these nomads? Before we ever met. The Order was founded to protect us from the nomads. About two months ago, a Rhineland expedition to an uncharted planet found... something. Soon after that, key positions in the Rhineland government were replaced, and Rhineland's politics became more and more aggressive. We believe these nomads attempted to infiltrate the Liberty government when Admiral Schultzke came to visit Manhattan. We had to prevent this at all costs, which is why we destroyed the Donau. We're approaching Kyoto. This is Lord Hakera. We are on approach. We have been awaiting you for some time, Lord Hakera. What news do you bring? Our mission was successful. We have the Proteus Tome and Lord Tekagi is dead. But we paid a high price for this. Lieutenant Ozu is gone. Understood. Long live the dragons. His sacrifice was not in vain. You are cleared to land. Dock. Understood. Your request to dock is granted. Proceed to dock two. This is hard to absorb, Mr. Trent. But Rhineland is not our only enemy in this conflict. More sacrifices are being made than you will ever hear in the news. Men like Ozu are dying every day. Can you really be so callous about him being killed like that? He knew the risks. Well, I didn't. Why didn't anyone tell me? What? That we were being invaded by an alien force we didn't understand? That we had finally come up against something that was more powerful than our own hubris? Hmm? Would that have helped? That's why the Order was formed, Trent. The peace we are fighting for. That's why it was so important for you and brave Ozu to get that thing at all costs. Because it's important to the Nomads. There. Now you know. How does it feel, Freelancer? Am I interrupting anything? No. Lord Hakira was just telling me about Ozu, how he died. I'm glad you made it back, though. Thanks to Lord Hakira. Unnecessary. But there is one thing that I do need your help with, if you're up to it. I owe you one, Hakira. Fine. Do you remember when we first met and I had lost contact with an operative of mine in Rhineland? Yeah. His name is von Clausen. 
He is an agent for the Order who operates deep in Rhineland space. He apparently has discovered vital information about Rhineland's plans, but we've had trouble contacting him. He is in terrible danger. His only chance is to be extracted. From Rhineland? New Berlin. You're perfect for the job because Bretonia is still neutral. I would ask Miss Zane to go, but for obvious reasons that would be inappropriate. Right. And besides, I'm sending her back with the Proteus Tome to Dr. Quintain. You must leave at once, Mr. Trent. I will make sure you have all the information you may need. Come along, Junko. Good luck. Alpha 1-1, this is Kyoto. Everything's a go for long. Trent, change of plans. Take the lead. We just got news that Rhineland has invaded the Sigma systems. All bases and jump gates there are now under Rhineland control. But there is another option. The Blood Dragons know of an uncharted jump hole in Sigma 13 that can take you all the way to New Berlin, if we move quickly. We will escort you there, then you are on your own. Dog. Lord Hakira, we are near the jump hole to Sigma 13. Proceed, Kobo. Trent, I will follow you through. Dog.
slow. Crest, give more power to the engines. I've got a cool link. Shield failed. Restore. Our pursuers have turned away. They have bigger fish to catch than us. With the Liberty Fleet advancing into Kepler, Kassar will get crushed Danger. in the middle. Radiation damage detected. What is this place? What you see here are the remains of the decisive battle in the 80-year war between Rhineland and the GMG. The jump pull is directly ahead of us. This jump pull will take you to New Berlin. This is as far as Lord Hikira and I can go. Kasari citizens in Rhineland are being arrested on sight. Or worse. Von Clausen is awaiting you on New Berlin. It is imperative that we bring him out alive. Good luck, Trent. Dog. My good sir, may we interest you in a reading for what the future may hold for you? No, thanks. Contact the dearly departed? Help you find someone? No. Mr. Blix here is never wrong about such things. He says you are looking for someone. For Herr von Clausen. Hmm. Does he speak for himself? Mr. Blix has connections to sources on a higher plane. And what about you? No, not I, sir. I was gifted with being a listener. Together, we are the eyes and ears for certain people who are willing to pay for such divine services. We are in the employ of one such man now. The man you seek. You see, we have been waiting for you for some time. Why? To deliver a message. To meet Herr von Klaassen on the old terraforming platform on the planet Holstein within the Frankfurt system. Don't worry, Mr. Trent. The guards are smiling upon you. When you get there, the time will be right. you on your way to Holstein. Follow me. We're taking the trade lane to the Frankfurt Gate. Dark. I'm also a good friend of Herr von Clausen. He and I have been providing Lord Hakara with information ever since the nomads infiltrated the Rhineland government.
Bishop Freya, identify yourselves. Freya, this is Dalman Freya, DHC 3417. We're transporting supplies to Planet Holstein. Acknowledge. DHC 3417. You're clear to proceed. Dark, Mr. Trent, please go first. military has been brutally suppressing any and all opposition to the war with Kusari. We are about to pass by Mannheim station. Word is that the military has detained hundreds of journalists and activists there. Nobody knows if they are alive or dead. Holstein. It's that water planet on our right. So far, so good. Dark. Trent, this is Hakkera. We have a slight change to our extraction plan. It is no longer possible for you to return to Kusari. The Rhineland fleet has invaded Honshu. We will rendezvous with you in the Hamburg system. I will transmit precise coordinates later. Akira out. Here we are. I've got a rendezvous with the Bunshu agent on the southwestern continent. Give my regards to Herr von Clausen. Good luck, Trent. Dog. Roger that. Stand by. Pattern is full. You will be clear to proceed when it's free. the liberty of reading your thoughts while you're on your Berlin. I'm sorry for the intrusion. I had to be sure that whoever Hacker has sent had not been tampered with. A man in my position can never be too careful. I understand. Now let's get you out of here while we still can. No arguments here, Mr. Trent. Right before I landed on Holstein, Hacker told me there's a change of plans. The Order will send ships to meet us in the Hamburg system. Plans. I have a piece of unfinished business I want to take care of. We have to fly to a nearby rebel base. An informant recently supplied me with construction blueprints for a new type of vessel being built by the Rhineland military. It is 
unlike any other ship, Mr. Trent. The design is alien. I have contacted a friend of mine who leads a rebel group that opposes the new Rhineland regime. Their base is not far from here. I'm glad to see you made it. And this must be your way out. Yes, my savior, Trent. This is Klaus Botzler, leader of the Bunshu rebels. How are you holding out? Very badly, I'm afraid. The Rhineland regulars have been hitting us with everything they've got recently. But we are still ready for you. Our attack wing will meet you both at the rendezvous point as planned. Excellent, my friend. Today we will put a stop to the Chancellor's secret weapon. quite a bit of damage to your ship. This operation is vital to the survival of both Rhineland and Kusari. If this war is allowed to progress, none shall survive. Stay alert and await my orders once we reach the end of the passage. We're here. All fighters break formation. Be careful, everyone. While the radiation in the field will damage your ship, the minefield is significantly more deadly. 
Stay calm and fly right. Let's go. Sensors show the passage is opening up into a huge open area. They are also picking up a massive installation. That will be our target. All fighters, arm weapons and prepare to engage on passage exit. For the sake of peace, that installation must fall at all costs. Von Clausen, I'm picking up another passage on the far side of the interior. We must use this passage as our means of escape. We will not survive a head-on fight with the capital ships. Herr Botzler, the right-hand battleships are keeping us away from the installation. We can't get a good shot. Can't keep together. Keep trying. That station must fall. Those nomad battleships must not be allowed to survive. All fighters, hit the installation with everything you have. And the target! This act will not go unpunished. been destroyed.
had to move the operation. The artifacts, the research, everything. Quintain and Sinclair are conferring with Aurelian now. Aurelian? Yes, Trent. This is his flagship. And this must be... Hervon Klausen! Sakura. You are here at last. Do you have the plans? I do, thanks to Mr. Trent. My compliment, Sakura. He's a fine addition to your group. Thank you again. Trent! King! You're here too? A lot of us are. Welcome aboard the Osiris. A fine piece of hardware from the Liberty Naval Labs. This is a Liberty ship? It was. It's an advanced prototype they never had the chance to use. The Order commandeered her right out from under their noses. Who makes off with an entire ship without getting caught? I do, Mr. Trent. My name is Gaspar Aurelian. Welcome to the Osiris and to the Order. So, Mr. Aurelian, you used to work for Liberty. For the deepest, darkest. I was their top agent, until I discovered the Nomads had taken over my CO. They wanted me too, but I managed to escape aboard this ship. That's when I committed myself to learning everything I could about the Nomads and their plan. I surrounded myself with recruits from all over the colonies, people like you too, to help rid us of the infestation. You mean the Nomads? That's right. They've been taking over human beings for some time now, controlling them. As near as we can tell, this all started when the Rhineland survey team discovered an uncharted planet. One that no human had ever set foot on. Unfortunately, when they penetrated its crust, the inhabitants that lived inside viewed us as a threat. So why not just attack us outright? Because we're too strong. They had to soften us up a bit. That's why the Chancellor started this war in the colonies. So when we're sufficiently thinned out, they can come in and mop up the rest. So the Chancellor is a host body for the Nomads too? Isn't it obvious? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a briefing to attend. Colonel Zane. Don't worry, Trent. No need to salute. What's happening here? Eh, more of the same. Colonel Zane. Sir. We've just gotten word that President Jacoby is still alive. I need you and Colonel Trent for a mission at once. Are you ready for this? Ready. Good. A loyal group of LSF members have apparently survived, and have been monitoring the President since her abduction. She's being held in the Alaska system. So now the Nomads have her. So it seems. What's her status? Unknown. But I want you to find out. Rescue. Or terminate. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Good. You are to hook up with the leader of these LSF operatives. A man named Walker. Marcus Walker? He's alive? You know him. We both do. Then good luck. Lord Hakata. I wanted to come and say goodbye myself. You're leaving? Something for Aurelian. I will see you again. Goodbye. Come on, Trent. It's time to rescue the President. We're back in business. to the jump hole. Trent, take the lead. King and I will follow you. Let's go. Colonel Zane, I'm hoping you can bring Jacoby back alive. Do you know how important she will be for the Order in the days ahead? Yes, sir. This is as far as the Osiris can take you. The jump hole to the New York Badlands is in the debris field a short distance from here. You will meet Walker at Buffalo, inside the Badlands. Aurelian out. I can't believe Walker is still alive. It'll be good to see him again. I'd started to fear the worst. Me too. I can't wait to hear his story. After he helped us escape from Manhattan, I'm sure the entire Liberty Navy was after him. There's the jump hole now. You first, Trent. I wouldn't be surprised if the Navy is guarding all the jump holes in New York by now. It's an 
ambush. Take these guys out. Walker is waiting for you inside. Thank you. Trent, you dock first. Pick up some ammo and equipment. I have a feeling we'll need it to get through this one. Dock. Acknowledged. Your request to dock is granted. Please proceed to dock one. for the order. <laughs> Giving up freelancing for a real cause? I'm impressed. It's the only one worth fighting for now. I hear you've got a line on the president. Indeed we do, but we'll have to hurry. Come on, let's get to work. Freelancer Alpha 1-1, this is Buffalo. You are cleared for launch. Good luck out there. Trent, good. We just received a message from Aurelian with new orders. Everybody ready? I have to rejoin my attack group on the far side of the Badlands. I'm sorry that I can't come with you now, but we'll meet you as planned at Zone 21. Understood. We'll see you at the rendezvous. Trent, take point. There's a jump hole nearby that'll get us very close to our target. What's the target? A new specialized satellite that the Navy deployed recently. Our sources say it's designed to detect cloaked ships. Like the Osiris. If we take out the satellite, Aurelian and the Osiris could operate in this system without being detected. We're coming up on the jump hole. Trent, after you.
satellite installation is very close. I'm uploading the coordinates to you now. Take the lead, Trent. Go to... My scanner's picking up the satellite. I'm not detecting any ships. Could be a trap. Joni, I'm reading multiple weapons platforms directly next to the satellite. Confirmed. Let's take this thing out quickly. We've got Navy fighters on an intercept course. We have to stop these guys. Proceed to the rendezvous. We've lost enough time here. Junie, what do you know about Alaska? It's not on any of the star charts. All I've ever heard were rumors. Me too. The only thing I know for sure is that the Navy has a jump gate at the heart of Zone 21. It leads to Alaska. Everything else is rumor or speculation. I've always heard that the Navy is constructing a secret fleet there. I guess we'll see with our own eyes soon. Walker, are you there? We're on our way. Acknowledged. We're already at the rendezvous point. Perfect. It's good to be flying with you again, Walker. Thank you, Junko. A lot has happened since you left Liberty. The democracy we once served is now a bloodthirsty military dictatorship. My crew and I were forced to leave the Central Systems. We've been prowling the independent worlds, destroying Rhineland supply depots. A strange life for a career Navy officer. These are strange times. True. Follow me. Danger. Mines detected. We have incoming hostiles. All units power up weapons. Protect the jump gate at all cost. Moving to intercept. Trent, King, engage the hostiles. Hostiles under fire. Holy! What kind of weapons are they carrying? 
There's no way we can handle this gate with these ships on our backs. Tanks destroyed. More hostiles incoming. Nice job, everyone. Watch my back while I run Aurelian's passcodes on the gate. Hurry. We're barely holding on here. I know.
meaning of this. Ah! I'm sorry about your shoulder. We tried to dress it as well as we could. He requested that you be taken unharmed. Who? Reed, you traitorous snake. Who requested? The Chancellor. I'm glad to see these fools didn't damage you too badly, my dear. But time is short. I wanted these few minutes to plant a seed, as it were. Any idea where they're keeping the president? Let's find out, shall we? I won't rest until I see you pay for this. I understand your anger, Madam President. I was misdirected at first, too. But then I had my mind open to other possibilities, as you will. Chancellor? Just shoot! Madam President, are you all right? But what the hell did you want? An engraved invitation? Look, I didn't... You were just gonna let that... that... Thing attack the president? I'm sorry, I haven't gotten used to killing political figures on sight yet. Trent, did he look like a human being to you? I'm telling you, I. Watch out! <laughs> Burn you, son of a bitch! This whole place is lit up. Form up. Let's get out of here. this time. What is that? Nomad ships, we've got to get to the jump gate. Do not engage the nomads. The jump gate is near. Stay on course. We'll make it. They blocked the jump gate. We're trapped. Incoming. There's only one way out. We have to punch through them. I'm going in. Contact to the engine room. to be done. The president is the only thing that matters now. Get her out of here. There has to be another way. No, there isn't. Now get out of here or you'll be killed too. Don't do this! Charges are active. Careful over the coordinating field. 
This is our chance! The jump gate is clear! Alright. Everybody head for the jump gate. We have to make a run for it! are closing. We have to get out of here. Report, Colonel Zane. Sir, we have Jacoby. The Chancellor's dead. So are several of his Liberty hosts. We have some weapons and raided their tactical files. Have it analyzed. We also lost some. Walker was one of them. Understood. I take it then the President is unharmed. Not exactly unharmed. But still me, if that's what you mean. Judging how everyone is acting, I assume you are the go-to man around here. President Jacoby? Meet Casper Aurelian. So, you're Aurelian. Thank you. Madam President, these are the people you should be thanking. Sir, we've cleared the Badlands. Your orders? Set course for Toledo. Tell Quintain we may have more information for him. Oh, and tell him we've got an official guest for him to meet. Do you remember, Trent, That's when right. I said people are changed by their world, rarely vice versa? No. Well, I did. You know what? I was wrong. Truly, for some people, they can change the world. We're doing it right now. Thank you for showing me that. You're welcome. Colonel, I never properly thanked you for what you did back there on the prison ship. You're welcome, Madam President. Mr. Aurelian was just filling me in on the Nomad's progress in the colonies. The information your team brought back has shown a clear spread of the contamination. 
All other colonies have now been affected, if not the leaders and key military units in the field. And they're getting stronger. Communication is breaking down. Soon this will develop into all-out genocide, with the nomads coming in to easily wipe out what's left. We need... What? We need a miracle. So, here we are, my friend, in the thick of it. I remember when you were fresh off the boat in Liberty. Seems like ages ago, doesn't it? Huh. <sighs> it's not the time. It's the sides that keep changing. Come on, you two. We have work to do. What? Work? Come on, Trent. It's just the kind of mission you love. What do you say? Sure. As long as I'm not shot at, knocked out, held at gunpoint, electrocuted, scared alive by giant alien shapeshifters, have to dive out windows, or fight off spindly nomad incubi, everything should be fine. It's something for Quintain and Sinclair. They need something. Big. How big? They say in order to activate the artifact, they need a nomad power cell. Oh, you've got to... Aurelian has located a nomad power source nearby. Once we have it, we'll head straight for the order base in Toledo. Let's go. Here's our intel. Long-range scanners have picked up a Nomad power source at the center of a giant structure. It's surrounded by a plasma cloud that prevents deeper scans. Are you detecting any Nomads in the area? Negative. The structure appears to be abandoned, but keep your eyes open. I'm uploading the coordinates. Listen. The jump hole we used to get here is destabilizing. We have to take the Osiris through now. It will be stable enough for small ships, but not for long. You have to get the power source quickly and get out of here. Understood. All right, people. Let's do it. Trent, you take point. King and I will take flanking positions. Go to... remaining to jump hole collapse. We're directly above the structure. No visuals yet. Look at the size of that thing. What the hell was that? Scanner's picking up massive readings. It's a trap! That thing is still alive! Damn, Intel was wrong. Nomads! They're everywhere! The power cell seems to be inside a central chamber. Looks like the only way in is through the vents on the top of the structure. Wait! We've got to bring that shield down first! Trent, I'm uploading the coordinates to you. The generators are located on the perimeter. They have to go down before you can enter. Eight minutes remaining to jump hole collapse.
work! of the structure. I'm sending coordinates. King and I will draw their fire, Trent. Head for the core and get that power cell.
you, Herr von Clausen. Long range radar had picked up increased nomad activity in this area. I thought you could use some help. We have to leave before they return. Head to Toledo. Trent, we have to go faster. that the Kosari fleet has been defeated near New Tokyo. No! The nomads are now freely roaming throughout the colonies. They've begun their attack on Britonia. Nothing can stop them now. Let's hope the artifact will. Professor Quintain has everything prepared. Land on Toledo. cells in the hold, guys. Take it directly to Dr. Quintain in the artifact lab. That was a little too close. Uh, next time, listen to your old pal King and uh, say no. As you know, Dr. Quintain and I have poured through the translations from the panels, the Proteus Tome, and even the stolen data from the prison ship. It seems that Dom Kavash had a vast empire long before man ever evolved. So if these guys were so much more advanced than us, where are they now? We don't know, Mr. Trent. There's no evidence to suggest any kind of war or disease or natural disaster that may have done away with them. They just vanished, leaving behind the nomads. It seems nomads, or whatever they were really called, we can't pronounce the name yet, they were apparently created by the Dom Kavash to... Well, look after things. We're fighting the caretakers? Well, in a manner of speaking. They are opportunistic parasites, not only of human beings, but of technology as well. Which brings us to the artifact. The Dam Kavosh had an amazingly advanced technology that was only partially based in these delicate formations. They used them for power, shields. Uh, well, this one is a, uh, well, we'll show you. Kendra? I discovered that if a computer sounded out the phonetic representation of the glyphs in a particular order... Please, Doctor, in deference to those of us who are simple politicians. Very well. The artifact knows where it is in space at all times. It's a map. But of what? Well, it's just a theory, but... Spit it out, Doctor. From what we now know, with an empire as large as the Dam Kavosh, they couldn't rely on simple jump gates like we have today. They had to develop something more sophisticated. 
A vast array of hypergates, linking the far corners of her empire via one incredibly fast system for travel. This device is not only the map, it's the trigger. A key to reawakening the system. Are you suggesting we turn this thing on? Yes. If we can reactivate the hypergates, we'll break the hold of the nomads on their power supply and cut them down to a more manageable size, in theory. Every key is a lock, Doctor. Where do we find this one? There. Mr. Trent. Me? Yes, you. I want you and Zane to spearhead this effort. Understood? All right. I've come this far, I may as well see it through. What's going on? Nomad, sir. A whole fleet of them. Prepare ships for intercept. Aye, sir. Damn it. They must have followed us. We have to evacuate. Everybody to their ships. Take only what you need. Trent, Juni. We have to buy some time. We're on it. Now how do we turn this Tinker toy into a weapon?
mission should be almost complete. We have to land quickly. Trent, we've made modifications to the artifact. It should work now. All you need to do is activate it in the right location. What's the status out there? It's unbelievable. The Nomads are constantly getting reinforcements. We won't be able to hold them off much longer. This is it. Everybody to their ships. Trent, Juni, escort the freighter with Gunta and Sinclair. All set, sir. Our forces will meet in the Nebula field on the far side of the system. Good luck. Quintain, fly directly to the rallying point in the Nebula. Trent and I will provide you cover. Understood. We're on our way. We're picking up another set of signals. Yet another Nomad capital ship is approaching Omicron. All combat wings concentrate your fire on that ship and whatever else they throw at us. It is imperative that we buy our people some time to evacuate. I'm heading to the Osiris. Colonel Zane, make sure that Quintain and Sinclair get safely to the rallying point. Yes, sir. Damn it. Trent, we have to protect the transport at all costs. Quintain, keep heading toward the Osiris. Understood. We have to get out of here. you to the Osiris. Roger that. What's the situation? We took heavy losses during the evacuation. Only four transports and about two dozen fighters made it back to the Osiris. That bad? To all units, I've arrived on the Osiris and we have reached the rallying point. Everybody, fall back. Dark. Approaching the Osiris. Okay, this is it. Go ahead and land, Trent. I'll meet up with you on the deck. Where is everyone? The briefing's already started. Let's go. Is everyone clear on their assignments? Uh -huh. Okay, then. Ah, Trent. Junko. Good, you've arrived. We're just now discussing our attack plan. Long-range scans have detected a Nomad jump gate in the area that will lead us to our final destination. We'll fly there through the Badlands, which should give us some cover from the Nomad attacks. We'll enter the jump gate and fly into what we think is the Nomad homeworld. Once there, we'll have to improvise. We'll break into four attack groups. Trent, you will lead Alpha Team. I'll lead Beta, and Colonel Zane will head up Gamma. A group of heavy bombers will maintain a holding pattern until we can clear them a path. Any questions? Okay, let's go. All right, you and stay. Let's get let's on. Herr von Clausen, you're coming with us? Yes, I am. We must still drive the nomads from our worlds and avenge those we have lost. I'm worried with you because I owe them something. I wouldn't miss it for the world. Good luck. Do it all.
Osiris is too large for the Nomad Gate and won't be able to assist us. According to our scans, the Nomad Gate is close, just outside the nebula. Expect heavy resistance once we clear it. That's our strategy. The Osiris will create a diversion on the other side of the system. Hopefully the Nomads will fall for it. Our strategy is to head directly into the Nomad Gate. We believe the alien homeworld lies directly on the other side. Our best chance is a frontal assault with everything we have. Doc. I see the gate. There it is. Look at that thing. I'm not picking up any ships. Keep your eyes open. The Nomads are bound to know we're coming. There! A Nomad battleship! All fighters, engage the Nomads! Thank you. 
job, Alpha.
city. A giant nomad city. I'm reading a strong energy field around the structure. We have to find a way to disable it. we destroyed earlier. Try taking them out. We'll cover you. Good shot, Trent. Damn it. No effect yet. Take out another one. Be careful, Trent. Looks like they're surrounded by defense platforms. I have a ship on my tail. Many lingering questions. Government officials remain tight-lipped about what has triggered this sudden change. In other news, LSF commander Junko Zane and freelancer Edison Trent, both former enemies of the state, have been granted full pardons and have received the Lone Star for Bravery, the highest decoration any individual in the colonies can receive. Though the details of the Liberty Ale, mister? No, thanks. I never told you. I asked the bartender about you the day we met. You did, did you? Mm-hmm. Sorry I'm late. The debriefing took longer than usual. I guess you can't rush the president. Or amnesty. Not to mention the generous reward. Hang on one second. I'll be right back. Aurelian. Let me tell Junie you're here. No, Colonel Trent. 
Even with the colonies rebuilding and the contaminated human population restored to normal, the threat isn't over. For now, it's better I stay less well known. I just wanted to see if you would consider a proposition. What sort of proposition? To be the eyes and ears of the Order here in Liberty. Think about it. Enjoy your vacation, Freelancer. I'll be in touch. Be seeing you, Casper. Trent, let me introduce Mr. Harrison, our newest diplomat. Mr. Harrison, Edison Trent. Edison? What an unusual name. Uh, call me Trent. Pleased to meet you. The pleasure is mine, Mr. Trent.